It began, as always, with the desire for power. The need to conquer. The hunger to consume. Inevitably, this led to conflict. Humanity fought an endless battle against itself until it was forced to unite against a power far greater than it had ever known. But even united, humanity left only destruction in its wake. Despite their best efforts at survival, the humans of Sierra continued to march blindly to their imminent doom. Unaware that their misguided attempts at retaliation were only leading them ever closer to extinction. They had thought us crippled by their weapons of mass destruction. But to survive is to endure and prosper. And we have most certainly survived. Jacinto now stands as the last bastion of humanity, a final desperate defense in the face of impossible odds. In a way, I pity them. But humanity, as always, brought this war upon itself. They're getting bolder. Those gears were guarding Pomeroy Depot. Damn, that's just down the road. Exactly. They're moving deeper every day. At least we got reinforcements. Yeah, but for how much longer? Okay, I'm heading to the hospital now. I need to check on that lead. Thanks, Anya. I... Good luck, all right? Sergeant Phoenix! Are you Sergeant Phoenix? Delta Squad? <coughs> I'm your new trainee. And Garena's grass by the looks of it. Time to train the Rook? <sighs> yeah, lucky me. Go easy on the kid, okay? Private Ben Carmine, sir! Reporting for duty, sir! Drop the sir shit, kid. We're not that polite out here. Come on, let's go. Oh, yeah. Welcome to Delta. It's an honor to serve with you, sir. I oh, my God. Sergeant. It's yes, Gears of War 2. Oh, my God. I, I loved this game when it first came out. I played it to death. And of course, at that time, I wasn't into multiplayer, so I just played the game like all crazy hell, the campaign and horde mode all by myself. Unless I was with a friend, then I'd be co-oping everything. It was quite a fun time. So, welcome back to the Gears of War franchise, which is at the time my favorite franchise and has been for the last few. Months? I don't know why. Ever, ever since I played Dead Space 2, it just this has taken over, and I I love Gears of War 3, but I know. Do unto others as you would have. Not out here, kid. Uh, stupid Carmine. Benjamin Carmine, easily my favorite Carmine brother out of the three that have been shown. Anthony didn't really get too attached to Benjamin Carmine. It's really nice. He revived me countless times when I was down on insane mode on this game. Okay, so basic controls. Um, it's a shooter! There you go, that's all you really need to know. Ace the sprint, that's really about it. Tuck, roll, sprint, go in the cover, that's really about it. 
There's a King Raven. Blah, 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 blah. I served with him. Oh. Are they? I never noticed that King Raven before. That's weird. Uh, yeah. Right. Oh my god. Hey, Marcus, check this shot. Okay, go, 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 go. You suck. Nice one. Do call that razor. Well, it sucked. Marcus. Dude. It's gonna take a while getting used to this high sensitivity, you could hit those in your sleep with and I'm gonna be too lazy to change it around. Be some more killer bottles there. Yeah, killer bottles. <laughs> We're gonna go kill us some killer bottle guys. We're gonna go have some fun. Gills of War. Um, yeah, this is a really good game. I feel like one of my favorites. And yeah, it didn't have exploding enemies left, right, and center. Though it was the introduction of tickers, and oh my god, tickers. Oh, <laughs> we'll get there when we get there. Whoop! Is it something to be jump over here now? Don't think so. Looks like he got away. You ever seen that before? Yeah, but they usually travel in packs. All right, stay alert and use cover. The other ones are probably around here somewhere. Come on, guys. Come on. Jump over the wall. Good job. Okay. Nice oh, look. Not an easy maneuver to make in full gear. Nothing here. Maybe they're in the alley. Let's check it out. One thing I like about Kills of War now that I'm realizing is that they have a lot of chatter in between the fights and all Grab that stuff. Few of those I just realized that. I'm so slow when it comes to realizing shit in video games. Like, I don't know. I just am. Stretch! Boom! Oh, it's dead! Oh, what? It exploded right behind it. You gotta be kidding me. There we go. No, don't throw it! No, you! Oh, wait a minute. That shouldn't hurt us. Oh, wait a minute. I lied. Alright, Dom. Let's get up. And let's just look at this guy for a moment. Bad Benjamin. Don't play with grenades. Oh, I can't get mad at you. Get up. Shit again, Rook, and you're gonna get some unexpected chainsaw training. That's Let's mean, Marcus. Here. He's one of the best characters ever, and by best, I mean nice. He's like, for once, not the stereotypical muscle guy. It's like this game. Alright, guys, let's go up to the land of happiness and look at the war vehicles. The centaurs, and I think they're centaurs, and the, um. I forgot their names. Well, wow. I know one's called Betty, though. Not, not, gr not grind lifts. No, no, no. That might be what they use to get down. All this damage came from your grenade. Yes. Sure as hell didn't come from yours. <laughs> oh my God. Nothing up here. Come on, you're so silly. Fail. Okay, so best thing about Gears of War franchise is the active reload system. I will always support that because it just it still adds a fun pacing to the battle. <clears throat> and. If you want to like get that 100% stuff going on, like every time you do an active reload, you get a bit of extra damage. Really helpful. I believe I already collected all the all the stuff, but you can't see that inside this one, which is unfortunate. So I'm probably not even going to look for them since well, I already have them. Let's get going, guys. We roadie run everywhere. Looks like vacation's over, kid. Is, Isn't this Jacinta? Head back to the convoy. I think this is Jacinta. Until I call you on your tatcom. But that's an order, soldier. Dom, let's move. Sweet. Well, that ends that part off. I'm moving on to next desperation. Woot! Anya, you still here? Still here, Marcus. Tell Dom I may have a. What'd you find? A lead on a Jane Doe, but it doesn't look like she... I'll fill you in later, Dom. I have to get back to control. All right, Anya. Sweep. Good luck. Damn it! Dom. Kill these goddamn brutes. Calm down. It's okay. Let's move. Don't, don't start asking questions. Questions like, where's my wife? And everything else. Ty! Good 
to see you. What are we looking at? Locust Street. Follow me. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh, I love how his textures never load up like that. coming in here like this. Doubt it has anything to do with courage. They just don't realize they've been sent on a suicide run. Maybe they're just desperate. What do you mean? Maybe the light mass bomb hit them harder than we thought. Or maybe something else is going down in the hollow. I don't know. Oh my god. Some of these patients have rust lung. Oh no. Whatever you do, you don't want to get rust lung. You will die. Very bad disease. You know, if you play Gears of War. Okay, Three. Delta, I'm back online. We have confirmed Locust presence in the hospital. I repeat, Locusts are in the hospital. Yeah, well now we've got a power outage too. I'm on it. I'll keep you posted. Control out. Sweet. Hold fire to if you played right Gears of War 3, us. then you would know what Rust Lung does, and can. it's terrible. Most of those supplies are actually fuel tanks, Delta. Part of the ambush. Good job! Let's shoot it with a Get pistol. Ready. Stuff done. So, I remember the day this game came out. I didn't have the. I was just playing Gears of War 1 because, well, I was trying to get used to the game, the third person shooter, so I could play Dead Space. And that was my first game. So, this game, I was playing Gears of War 1 with a friend, getting used to third person shooters. And then. Gears of War 2 comes out, and I'm like, well, I really like the first one, actually, so... Well, I want to play the second one. Well, my friend's bigger brother got the second game the night or the day of release. Well, actually, the night of, because as soon as it was released, we went out at night to go get it. And... I played until the end of Act 3, I think. Inside one sitting, after staying up for more than 24 hours, so... I was really into the game, and that was before I was got good at the campaign. I'm still not amazing, but I can beat the game on the insane difficulty, except for Scourge. Oh my god. You'll see who Scourge is when we get there. So, a fun fact I never knew is that you could actually take the other door, which is, well, I don't know, I never knew this. I thought it was fun when I first found it. I was like, you know what, I'm going to go try down going here first and have these guys cover me. And I wish I used this on the insane run when I did it, but no, I didn't. Because, well, they could revive me down here, and everything would have been alright. Okay. Do I have a shotgun yet? Nope, of course not. The one thing I really don't like about the first two games, you don't get the Nasher until way too late. So, Gears of War, man. Just, it's been about two weeks since I last recorded which was part 62 of Skyrim so that gives you a timeline on when I'm recording this and exams are coming up and I actually instead of planning I'm either playing Skyrim on my new account which I have the new account being a beast level 45 right now and I just got done taking on an ancient dragon giant and uh, ancient dragon giant and mammoth with barely any scratches, so I barely took any damage, which I was impressed about. I, I really liked the battle. It was fun. So, exams have been coming up, and I'm, I should be studying, but here's the thing. I have free time right now, so I'm recording a little bit of this far in advance. Not much. I only plan on doing Act 1, which is going relatively smoothly. Maybe I should up the difficulty to hardcore because this is being insanely easy um yeah but still yeah see look at this I'm just up and I'm still shooting I'm just shooting that's all it's not like I, I flank them they have a perfect advantage well we had now they're just getting raped maybe I did flank them I don't know killed them all Move on. You're gonna have this guy coming up here. Don't want to fight him, so we're gonna go up here. But I have a little bit of free time, and once I'm done with this, I'm probably gonna start studying. 
because I have some exams coming up, and then I have a Spanish oral, which I'm not looking forward to. I did pick up the bolt attack, right? So, my life is going to be pretty filled up coming up in the next month. And by the time this is uploaded, that month will have passed, and I will be, like, scared. Because, oh my god, I'm not looking forward to, uh, I don't know what day it is in February, but I have to do a full 10 minute conversation in Spanish. And I'm not very fluent at it at all, I can read, like, some of it, and write some of it, but can't speak it, like, at all. I <laughs> My speaking skills are garbage, to say the least. Anyways, this is the Hammer Burst. One of my friend's favorite weapons, and was the weapon choice. Whoops, was the weapon choice in the MOG Gears of War 2 for a while, and then they got rid of it because of the headshot bonus that you could get with it. So the Lancer came too, and it's just you couldn't use the chainsaw on the Lancer, I believe. I don't know. 